Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm not really teaching anything, but I haven't posted a one in a while. So I thought it would be fun to kind of go over what I've purchased the past few weekends, I guess, with all the cyber deals going on and things like that. Um, I got mail today and I was like, that could be fun to just kind of give a check-in on things I've purchased and you guys can comment below and let me know what you've been purchasing. So, um, let's start with Decoville. This is from uh, gotinterfacing.com. She sells Decoville by the roll. Um, this is really expensive, but I use so much of this and I had just run out and I was like, well, Merry Christmas to me. I guess I'm getting another roll of Decoville. Um, so that's one thing that I've purchased just recently. Um, and I think she had like a 5% sale on Black Friday weekend. I ordered before that and didn't get the sale, so I'm a little bummed, but not a, not a big deal. Um, and then something I got today from Moonbeam Textile Company. Um, a few months ago, they had a Star Wars fabric for pre-order, and they were selling half yards, which I've never really seen um, a fabric company do that before, and I thought that was really cool. It was $10 for a half yard, and it's like, if you're not really making a bunch of stuff with the fabric, what do you need a yard for? So they're so stinking cute. Um, it's a floral Star Trek, and then it's just, you know, half a yard. So you can make um, a little underwear set or some kids clothing out of it or something like that. Um, and I was like, may as well get all of them. So that was those two. And then they have a vintage fandom Paisley, which is um, a Star Wars print. That's Paisley. I was like, look at those colors. Um, so I don't know anything about how well this washes. It does feel a little bit thinner than some of the um, um, spandex that I've ordered, but it's not bad. I'm excited to play with it. Um, something else I got in the mail. This is actually for website orders that I have, um, but this is a yard of linen cotton canvas from Spoonflower. And the way I design my fabrics, because I design fabrics, is I'll put um, a square the size that I need. So all of these are going to be totes. And I can just cut them and interface them and make the totes. So that's that. Um, this is from fwdfabrics.com. And they sent a coupon code as well that you guys can use. Um, for $5 off of $35, which isn't hard. Um, this is all waterproof canvas. Um, what colors did I get? I got Kelly Green, Black, Royal, and I think Turquoise. Um, I have so many colors you can see up here, and then I have some more on the floor. But I was like, they're having a sale, I can't resist. Um, so this is what I use to line most of my bags because you don't have to interface it. It's waterproof. Um, it's just really awesome to use. My friend Lily suggested I use it and she heard from other bag makers, you know, it goes on and on all the way to the top. And then um, the last thing I have here is leather that I purchased from Tandy Leather in uh, Kansas City. I was there for a show on Black Friday and um, Small Business Saturday. That was pretty terrible, but I got to meet some new people, so that was fun. Um, but they had these designer leather hides on sale for $7.99 and I had my two friends Ashley and Josie with me and I was like we're getting there at 10 we're gonna stock up <laughs> we're all gonna grab some so I got um, a good amount of these and they're pretty nice size you know they're not too too big but these are great for like making little wallets or um, you know just accents on wristlets. They're not too thick. I'm excited. So these are the designer hides from Tandy, um, and they were $7.99 a piece. Um, so I got a metallic gold, really high shine. I got this like uh, old gold, really soft textured hide. Uh, this one is more of a platinum color. Um, really soft um, and then a metallic silver Ooh, blinding yeah but it's really soft uh, the back is really nice it's not too thick I'd say this is probably like one to two ounce leather um, 
I don't know. It doesn't say. They also had this seafoam green. It's kind of hard to see, but there you can see the color. Um, my friend Ashley grabbed this one, and I was like, yes, grab more. So I've got two of those. Um, they had this, like, bronze one that's really pretty, a tan bronze color. Um, and then one that's a little bit deeper, metallic brown. You guys, we went crazy. A little too crazy. Um, there's, like, a an onyx color, almost black. Another old gold. Another almost black one. And then there's, like, a champagne and a gold. And they're all so soft and pretty. I love them so much. I'm so glad they came with me. Um, and then I also got some sides that were kind of on sale, but also too pretty to pass up. This one's a really pretty chocolate brown that has like a little bit of uh, distress to it. Sorry. Terrible lighting, guys. I'm real professional. You know that. Um, and then I got this red. I could not pass this up. I don't have any red leathers, and I was like, it's just too pretty to pass up. Um, I'm trying to think of any other purchases I've made this week that are sewing related. Oh, I bought some more, um, great, great angle, um, some more fabric snips. I stupidly, very, very stupidly, um, put these underneath my sewing machine foot, and bent the crap out of mine. So real smart move on my part. But if you do not know about these, um, they are easy snips from Tula Pink. Oh, a fresh pair is so nice. I have so many of these floating around, but I just love them so much. Um, and they're great to magnet to your sewing machine and just like clip your threads away. Um, so yeah. Hmm. Did I cut the top off? Maybe it comes like that. I don't know. But that's it for me. I would love to hear down below what you guys have purchased during the cyber deals that were going on. I know a lot of you guys have posted in my sewing group and I love seeing what you guys have purchased. We're just a whole bunch of enablers and it's pretty bad. <laughs> um, but thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.